Hi everyone, welcome back. This is M.A. Canva from Mira PG Medical. And in this video, we are going to discuss about the seat matrix of TN medical selection for MS and MD. Uh, the branches wise, we are going to see and category wise also and see how many seats are for, how many seats available for open category and uh, BC and BCM, MBC, SC, SCA, all we are going to see. And exactly how many seats are available and for the state counseling as well as all India quota counseling, right? And stay connected till end of the video. And I have given the clear tabular column, then it will be help you out. And second thing that before going to the video, and all might be aware of the, the increasing of seats, 5,700 plus in MCC counseling due to the conversion of the 50% uh, of the seat of private and deemed colleges uh, into the government fee. Right. And I don't think this is possible to uh, get the fee down equal into the government fee uh, with the private college from, from the private colleges as well as deemed university. Absolutely, it is not possible to match with the government fee, but there may be some discount or there may be a, some kind of uh, reduction may maybe happen. But still, it is not a com com confirmed or finalized and premised also that he has tutored and NMC also, they have given the instruction to the colleges, but nothing has so, come out from uh, as of now. So how they are going to formulate and what is the for feasibility studies and nothing is finalized. And according to my view, I can say it is 50-50% so of choice chances there. And now the Orissa state has initiated the process not to at par with the government fee, they have asked the private colleges and the university to bring the uh, what is that uh, to bring that proposal uh, with the relevant documents everything. So I so from this juncture I can make out this is uh, have this will be happen with some discount some kind of the reduction in the fee only. So how much it is going to be reduced that also we have to wait and see. Okay guys and let us move into the video now. See. MD, MS, seat matrix, category based, all in the quota and um, state quota council. Okay. And to see this. Now, I have given the tabular column for the, I have taken the for MD branches, and this is the nine branches I have taken radio and general medicine, derma and pediatric and radio oncology and respiratory medicine, anesthesia and psychiatry, uh, psychiatry and geriatrics. Okay. And uh, see, I have given the total seats available in TN medical selection uh, for including that all India quota, uh, 50% seats, 943. So like that, an all India quota for 469 is going to uh, out. Then Tamil Nadu state counseling seats will be total 474 seats for this entire nine seat, nine branches. Okay, I have given the OSC how many seats uh, branches wise it is going and BCLs are given and MBCM and MBC, SC, SCA, ST. Okay, and uh, see OSC total seats are already 149 and BC 126, BCM 17 and MBC 95, SC 70 and SCA 13 and ST 3. Okay, these open category seats almost will be filled from the other categories also, BC, BCM, NBC also. So all the topper will go to the open category. They will be allotted in the open category only by looping rule or looping method, correct? So uh, like that, so if it is BC, 17 seats are actually available, but after the counseling, there must be five to six uh, seats will be increased by looping method into OC category. Okay, so these are all 149 categories, so around 50% of the seats will, will go to the BC and 10% will be for BCM and 20% according to the proposal ways it will go. Okay, and even other forward community, the open, the general seat candidate also, they will come. Okay, and this is the for MD. Okay, if you look at the MS degree, uh, this is a uh, tabular for, I have taken the five one, general surgery, OBG, ortho, and END, and ophthalmology, right? And I have given the 805 seats totally available, and out of that, 401 is going for the All India quota, and Tamil Nadu state quota is 404 seats, and OC 125 seats, BC 108, and BCM 15, MBC 82, SC 60, SC 11, ST 3. I have given the branches wise also. I have given the category wise also. So you can take a screenshot uh, of the table, this table, that it will help you out. 
So these are the actual seat matrix. And next video, we will see that the quality of seat matrix and how many uh, cutoff markers are available. Everything we will see that. And uh, this is, for example, uh, for BCM, if you take BCM, so last year for MS degree, around 20, 22 seats. So in the round one, they have filled it. So out of 15, 25, 22 seats are they filled. Even like MD also, it was 17 only, but 22 seats to the round one, it is filled it because of the looping role, right? And this is the, uh, definitely this video will be help you out for the uh, NEET uh, PG 2022 aspirants. So your counseling makes definitely it is going to be happen on August only. There is a EWS issue is there in the Supreme Court. The Supreme Court verdict is expected in July only. They have already told July. So by August, first week or something, the council will start. So definitely the September will be the academic year for 2022, right? Otherwise, and if this video is to help you out, I mean, uh, it will be uh, really help you, uh, helpful to you. And please do subscribe and share it with your friends also. Stay connected for further updates. Thanks for watching. Take care. Bye-bye.